Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Yo, <laughs> I'm not even started yet and I'm getting a follower. Ctorian2142? Or oh, I'm probably, I probably said your name completely wrong, but thank you for the follow, I appreciate it. Oh, I'm not even started, I'm not even started the stream yet, I'm not even started playing yet, Jesus. <laughs> Alright, so hello guys, how's it going? As you can see from the title of the stream, we are going to be playing a blind run of Majora's Mask. Now, here's the thing. This is... I mean, it's blind in the sense that I've never actually played through Majora's Mask before. I've never done a playthrough of it in my life. I'm a big Zelda fan. Yo, Derek, with the 12 bits as well. Oh, that's, that's the new... The new Halloween uh, cheer up I see there. Nice, thank you very much, man. I appreciate that. But, um... Yeah, so, like, I've never... I'm a big Zelda fan. I've played tons of Zelda games. I just never played Majora's Mask. But, the thing is... I did play it when I was younger. And I, I played it when I rented it from, like, Blockbuster. And I never finished it because I just didn't really get into it. And I've just never went back to it. Um, but, obviously, being a big Zelda fan. And, obviously, being a big, you know, pers person that plays a lot of video games. Kind of hard to go your life without knowing anything about Majora's Mask, so I do know some stuff about the game. There are elements of the game that I do know about, obviously, because how the hell would I not know about things from Majora's Mask? But this is still going to be my first ever playthrough. There's still going to be probably plenty of things in the game I've not don't know about surprises, and uh, just in general, my first my first time actually trying to play it. So hopefully this will be fun. Hopefully this will go well. Um. Hold on, actually. Give me a second, I need to actually check something real quick. Uh, is this? I don't actually remember if I did. I did not. Okay, there we go. My boy, my, I, had my, I forgot I had my mic on a little bit of a delay there. For when we were playing games on my... Uh, on my console, but that's fixed now, so we should not have any delay going on. But let's get started, shall we? Let me get this loaded up, and we will begin. Oop, that's the wrong thing. There we go. Hey. All right. I don't know how loud this is, so I apologize if it is really loud. <laughs> well, there's the happy mask man having himself a laugh about something. Alright. Alright, you guys can let me know if the game is too loud or too quiet anyway. Actually. Alright. High sound mixer. Yeah, that was actually kind of on there for a second, my bad. I guess we should watch the little intro thing. Well, we'll see what happens, Jairo. And also, hello, welcome. Oh, God. I thought I'd see a go on with a pink bow tie. Put on some clothes, man. This is a kid's game. Jesus, I can just about see your fish taco. Nice woman. Oh, big ass bell. Oh, there's one of the face. So I know about those. Something something to do with the the great fairies are like scattered into pieces, and you have to like find them. So you like put them back together. I think. Up oh, there I am. Just hanging out. So this is the ah, uh, what's the place called? Clocktown? Is it called? Is it Clocktown? The main the main town's called. I think it's that. Something like that. 
Oh, and there's Skull Kid. He's being a little creep. And the thing that gave probably every Zelda fan when they were younger nightmares. This is a 100% run, yeah, totally. 100%. It's going in 2000. Damn. 17 years. That was 10. Alright. Oh, yeah, I did a test. I, did, I, I had a test file. Just to make sure the game ran okay. Masks. Zero. Cool. I know there's a I know so I know there's a ton of different masks you get in this. I think isn't like a lot of them optional as well, like you don't actually need to get all of them. I assume there's probably a bunch that are just probably like just somewhat useful to have, but you don't actually need to be the game. I probably should be reading this. I'm assuming Okay, so I'm assuming this is just Link, saved Hyrule, and now he's on a journey to find a friend who he parted ways when he finally fulfilled his periodic destiny and took his place among legends. What, Navi? He's coming to f this whole journey to this new area, this new land, is to find Navi? It's kind of weird how she just kind of left <laughs> at the end of Ocarina of Time. She's like, well, my job's done. Bye. <laughs> she just leaves. There we are. I'm also curious about how we got a Pona. Because, like, in Ocarina of Time, you weren't able to really tame and ride her until you were both adults. But now, all of a sudden, like, just went to Lonely Ranch and like, I'm going to take this horse. See ya. Oh, oh, well, that's just... alright. Good job, Epona, getting spooked by two fairies. <laughs> Doesn't even care that we fell off and could have broke our necks. She's just like, alright, back to eating grass and stuff. Such a wee creep. <laughs> you two fairies did great. I wonder if he has anything good on him. Huh? This guy? Well, that shouldn't be a problem. So is this one of the skull kids that were actually in like the Lost Woods? Is or something that knows Link or has like seen him before? Because he, he said this guy like he knows who Link is. Or maybe he just knows about I'm saving Hyrule. Alright, just, you know, help yourself. I like how Link's knocked out. It's like he fought so many, he was able to fight bosses as a child like 20 times bigger than him. But then he falls off a horse and he's like, alright, I'm out. <laughs> Cold. <laughs> Oh, oh, what a pretty ocarina. Hey, Skull Kid, let me touch it. I want to see. Assuming that's one of the fairies. Yes. The purple one? You can't tell? What would we do if you dropped and broke it? No way, you can't touch it. Wow. Ah, oh, but sis, why? Why can't I try it out? Too. <laughs> He's really finding that ocarina hilarious. He's having a grand time. Good job. Oh. oh, okay, he's just gonna take my horse. Oh. Wild. <laughs> I'm just holding on to his leg, Jesus. Fucking talk about getting carpet bombs on your legs, like Jesus. Alright, see you later then. Well, this isn't a great start for us. Fucking got mugged, got our horse stolen. Christ. Alright, hey, we're playing. Oh, we have a sword already? Yeah! Oh, I got a cool shield as well. Alright, buttons. Why do I have that set to that? I may have to change that.
Oh, there's songs in this? I don't know there are songs in this, I remember. Actually, there's like... Songs to like turn back time and stuff, I think. Yeah. Alright. Give me a minute, opponent. I gotta cut grass to try and get some rupees here. I'll be with you in a second. Wait, can I cut grass by just... Interesting. Cut, cut, here. Yeah. Alright. Let's see if you're as trash at this as... Uh, there. Let's see if you're as trash as Z-Target as Crash is. Well, I mean, I've played a bunch of Ocarina of Time, so... This is basically the equivalent of a ROM hack of Ocarina of Time, and it's literally just the same game with a new coat of paint. So I'm assuming I'll be fine. Yo, I... Oh my god, how do I... <laughs> Unique username, hello. Yeah, you did, we've literally just started. And Satoria, Satorian as well, hi. Seen you gave us a follow earlier, how's it going? This game would be hard as fuck without the songs. I'm assuming so that I know, so I know obviously about the whole, what's happening? The whole 3 day thing. Up. What's with that stupid horse of yours? It doesn't listen to a word that's said to it. There's no point in writing a thing like that, so I did you a favour and got rid of it. <laughs> wow! I mean, you could have just been like, you have your horse back, I don't want it because it's shit, but I mean, that's just a dick, that's just a dick move. Oh, boohoo, why the sad face? I just thought I'd have a little fun with you by, by stealing my horse and getting rid of it. That's fun to you? Oh, God. Ah, here we go. Get rid of it. <laughs> Holy days. Yo, unique username, thank you for the follow as well, I appreciate it. Yeah, I've played, this is like one of the only Zelda games I haven't played. Like, I've I've done a, I've played a ton. I've basically played nearly every Zelda game except like this one and maybe like a few of the handheld ones. Ocarina of Time is like one of my favourite games. I just, those games just kind of pass by me. Well, that's terrifying. So now we're a Deku scrub. I mean, you could have turned us into something nicer. Eh, now that's a good look for you. You'll stay here looking that way forever. <laughs> Just floats away laughing. Alright, see you later. Ah. Uh, Alright. Really? It's not enough I get turned into a Deku scrub, but I get my arse kicked by a fucking fairy. Just a sis. Oh, rip. See, that's karma right there. That's what you get. Whoa, whoa, skull kid, wait for me, I'm still here. Tail, you, can, you can't leave without me. Mwah. You. If I wasn't dealing with you, I wouldn't have gotten separated from my brother. How is that my fault? You could have just left. Jesus. Well, don't just sit there, Deku boy. Do something. Oh, yeah, let me fucking get right on helping you. Why are you looking at me like that? What, is there something stuck to my face? Will you stop staring and just open the door for me? Please, come on. A helpless little girl is asking you, so hurry up. A helpless little girl that was just kicking the shit out of you two minutes ago. Oh, Tail, I wonder if that child will be alright on his own. Okay then. So now we attack. My sword and shield just vanish from my body. That grass moved. What? But now the grass is alive? The shit. Always knew you were a scrub. Wow, rude. I'd rate this as good as Ocarina. I'm surprised you haven't played it. Which was Masks kind of divided. People either really like it or really don't. Definitely one of the harder ones for the whole time thing, I think. Yeah. I mean, that's the thing, I played it, I played Ocarina of Time when I was, like, like, the first Zelda game I ever played was Ocarina of Time. It was the first Zelda game I'd even heard about, um, growing up, because I was, like, really young. And me and my sister and my dad all, we got it and, like, all played it together. Hey, wait for me, don't leave me behind. So, um, that stuff back there, I, um, apologise, so, so, so take me with you. 
You want to know about that skull kid who just ran off, right? Well, I just so happen to have an idea of where he might be going. Take me with you and I'll help you out. Deal? Please? Yeah. Good, so then it's settled. Now then, I'll be your partner, or at least until we catch that skull kid. My name's Tattle. Oh, I get it, Tattletail. Ha <laughs> ha! So, fucking... <laughs> Now that we've got all that straightened out, can we stop messing around and get moving? If I figure something out, press up and I'll tell you to you, blah blah blah. Okay. Basically just our new Navi. Nice. Um, yeah, so like I, I played Ocarina of Time a bunch when I was a kid, and then I remember I saw Majora's Mask uh, in like the local blockbuster, and I rented it with my pocket money because I was like, oh, another Zelda game, awesome. And I remember I played the first couple of hours of it. And I just remember not really liking it too much. I don't know why. It just didn't really grab me the same way Ocarina and I did. So I just was like, eh. And I just took it back and just never played it again because it was rented. So I just ended up taking it back. And just that was it. And just over the years, I've just never really got around to playing it again. And I figure best. Not me to do that. I figure the best way to play a game like this that I've never played before would probably be on my stream. Because I'm. You guys can all laugh at me for being horrible at this game. And also probably get butthurt for me not knowing where to go all the time. As people usually do on, sh on Twitch and YouTube. Chest. Hey. So does it not do the whole... Wishy wishy stuff with the chest anymore? The whole... It takes about 20 years to open a chest. Doesn't do that anymore. Oh well. I mean, it's not a big loss, exactly. It's actually probably better not to have something like that. How far did I get when I originally played? I mean, this was like nearly 20 years ago. So, I honestly don't... I don't think I even made it to the, like, the first dungeon, in all honesty. Like, I don't think I even made it as far as that. So, that can give you a general idea, maybe. But it was a long time ago, so... It's strange, but the way you look right now sort of looks like this, that tree. It's all dark and gloomy. Almost like it could start crying any second now. Bad. Oh. Tree. He dead. <laughs> hmm. It's kind of like the forest temple thing. Where you're being all twisted. Strange. What the hell am I? Da -da -da. Da -da -da. Now we're on the car. I'm gonna waterworks thing. Hmm. So just go. Oh, you've met with a terrible fate, haven't you? Now oh, there's this creep. What's up, mask salesman? I own the Happy Mask Shop. I travel far and wide in search of masks. And some of them are very, very scary. The one, the the, the one like the, the one closest to his butt, kind of looks like a real person. I wonder if that's maybe like one of the developers or something that they turned into a mask. Because it actually kinda looks like someone. Rather than just some kind of monstrosity. During my travels, a very important mask was stolen from me by an imp in the woods. So here I am at a loss. And now I found you. Now, don't think me rude, but I have been following you. Alright. For I know of a way to return you to your former self. If you can get back the precious item that was stolen from, uh, if you can get back the precious item that was stolen from you, I will return you to normal. Oh, my ocarina, then I guess is what he means by that. In exchange, all I ask is that you also get back my precious mask that the imp stole from me. What? It is not a simple task. Why? To someone like you, it should be no means by it should by no means be a difficult task. Can't read today, apparently. Except, the one thing is, I'm a very busy fellow, and I must leave this place in three days. 
How grateful I would be if you could bring it back to me before my time here is up. But yes, you'll be fine. I see you are young and have tremendous courage. I'm sure you'll find it right away. Well then, I'm counting on you. Alright then. Have a look at your masks. Yeah, some of them are very, very creepy. Jesus. Dawn of the first day. 72 hours remain. Hey, ah, uh, that's Clock Town. That's what I thought it was called. That's Clock Town. Clock Town. He gives me the creeps, that mask salesman. Wait, what? He gives me the creeps? That mask salesman was the... Sorry, just thinking about... But uh, three days? Even if we... Even if we never sleep, that still leaves us with a measly 72 hours. Talk about demanding. Well, don't just stand there. We're going to see the Great Fairy. Look, you want to find the Skull Kid, don't you? The Great, Fairy's, the Great Fairy will know what he's up to. She watches over everything. And just between you and me, the Skull Kid is no match for the Great Fairy. Go to the shrine near the North Gate. You'll find the Great Fairy in there. Okay. Ah, what the fuck? The hell just attacked me? Oh, the dog. What is your problem? You oh, fucking come here. That damn dog. Jesus, man. That was so unnecessary. And racist ass dogs. The door to the clock tower stairway opens at midnight on the eve of the carnival. Firework show will mark the occasion. Clock down carnival executive committee. Okay. okay. East Clock Town. Ah, oh, these guys. Jugglers now, apparently. Sup? My, my, funny things are happening in town, aren't they? Funny, funny. You're telling me, like the rumours about the swamp to the south? Did you hear about the kidnapping? Oh my, the kidnapping? Yep. Ah, then the kid woke up, get it? Kid, napping? Oh, I got a million of them. I should fucking stream on Twitch. <laughs> Alright, well, that was helpful. I don't even know. I guess I'll just go into random doors and just see what I can find. Town shooting gallery. I don't think we have any way of shooting stuff, so... Oh, when I saw that video, I thought you were that trouble... Make, that trouble making Brap the mask. Sorry, but you can't play if you don't have a bow. Well, see you then. Building's a giant chest. What the hell? Did I just go back to South? I did indeed. How the hell did I get in here? I feel like a building with a giant chest must have some pretty useful stuff in it. Oh. Whoa. Treasure chest shop. What the fuck? Oh, what a cute little customer. So, do you want to play? Only 10 rubies? Sure. If you can make it all the way to the treasure chest and open it, within the time limit I'll give you a special prize. Finding out what's inside is half the fun. If I can... What do you, what do you mean if I can make it? Is it like a maze or something? Oh, it is a maze. Are you kidding me? Oh, Jesus. That wasn't too difficult, to be honest. Really? All that for some... Ten I basically paid ten rupees to get some deco nuts. That's pretty garbage. Did you have fun? Won't you try again? No, fuck you. <laughs> Barely worth my time. Guess I should equip these. Alright, well.
Oh, hello. Wait, small child? Who are you? What's with you? You're wearing a weird hat for a Deku kid. You come to town to play? I bet nobody will play with you, right? The adults are all busy getting ready for the carnival. The old astronomer at the observatory outside town is the only one who spends any time with playing with us kids. Um, I'm not even gonna. Well, uh, we we bombers have our hideout at the observatory. You have to t take a secret route to get to it. Oh, don't be telling Jim in North. Don't be telling Jim in North Clock Town that I told you that. Okay. Let's see where I can actually go with this. Over here, maybe? Yeah. Yeah. But what is in here? The stock pot in. Oh no, it's this guy. Oh. Do, 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 do. Don't speak to her right now. She hasn't finished her new dance for the town carnival. Do, do, da. Even though the song is finished. Okay. Hello. Judo's very good at it. Maybe we should add some spins. Okay. Is that all this in here? Okay. No. Bye bye. Sting into other people's rooms? You're the worst. Alright, well. Excuse me. We all love the windmill guy. Oh, okay, employees only. That's cool. Oh, hello. Oh, wait, that's probably just the way. Yeah, that's the way back out. You gotta love windmill guy. The Song of Storms. That was Tay, yay, yay. I just saw what's her face. Chicken lady. You have Kajiro with you? Kajiro. Where the hell did she go? What? <laughs> she like vanished. Oh. Excuse me. Excuse me. I'm trying to speak to you. Alright, fine. Rude. Oh, you are. What, are you, what, what even are you? That's some nose you've got. Oh, Tortoise. Did you finish helping father? What? Then let mother read you a story. Hey, what story would you like to hear? Carnival of Time, two hours, four giants till morning. Well, I, I feel like I probably shouldn't waste any of the precious time that I have on stuff like that, so I'll just leave. Nope. What the hell is this? A toilet? It doesn't even have a door to it? The hell, man. Disgusting. Guess we'll just leave. Doesn't seem to be anything of interest in here. Nope. Oh. <laughs> Hello. I'm currently on the job. If I stop to talk, I will disrupt my schedule. Okay, well, I'll see you then. Oh, hello. Where does this go? Both clock down. Oh, hello. Oh, come on, like you can climb that. Yes. Oh, no, dog. Piss off. Oh. Wait, wait, hang on. Hello? Um, this is my private property. Don't try using it when I'm not around. No. Oh. I've already sold out of my wares and the carnival hasn't even begun. I'm thinking of closing up shop so I can buy a gift for my wife and return to her in my village. I've heard that a store called the Moon's Tear shines brighter than any other in the land. If you've got one, I'd really like to get it from you. My wife would love it. If you give it to me, I'll give you my spot here. Deku flower included. Press that to open this up. Okay. Well, I don't. No. You're a Deku scrub. You're a Deku scrub, so you know just how convenient and how convenient. A Deku flower can be. If you don't hurry, I'll give it to another Deku scrub. The early scrub gets the nut. <laughs> early scrub. 
gets the nut. That's a fucking amazing quote for 2017. Yo, what the hell's this? Ye who, hold, ye who hold the sacred sword, leave proof of our encounter. Alright, you know what that means? Need to find the north part of town, though. How the hell do I get to the north? West clock town, alright, well. I think I've been literally everywhere except north. The secret route to the observatory? How do you know about that? Only Jim and us are supposed to know about the secret route. Oh well. That's a big, big guy. Hey there little guy, won't you deposit some rubies? Nowadays even if people have money they don't deposit any. Nothing, nothing. So for a limited time I'll give you a special gift based on how much you deposit. For example, if you deposit 200 rubies, you'll get an item that holds a lot of rubies. Ah, uh, no fact. I've only got nine. Don't, don't really see the point in doing that, so... Oh, kid. The secret route of the... Ah, okay. Oh, I'm back here. How the hell do I get to the north part of town? Uh, excuse me. Wait a moment, Deku Scrub, have you some errand at the ocean? It's dangerous outside the town walls, so I cannot allow a child like you to go out alone. Until you're old enough to carry a weapon, you cannot pass through here without being accompanied by an adult. Alright, I guess I gotta be Link with my sword again before he'll let me by. Okay, so that's li literally all of the west part of town. What's up here, then? Weird mask on the balloon. North Clock Town. Here we go. It's with the balloon. It's got Majora's mask on it. And there's a heart piece up there as well. Oh, look at fucking this. It's the nonce himself, Tingle. Jesus Christ. What's that? Green clothes? Why, fairy? Sir, could you by chance be a forest fairy? Oh my. <laughs> my name is Tingle. I think I am the same as you, sir. A forest fairy. Alas, though, I am or I, <laughs> I am already aged 35. No fairy has come to me yet. I wonder why. My father tells me to grow up and act my age. But why? I tell you, Tingle is the very reincarnation of a fairy. Now, while I stand here waiting for a fairy of my own, I sell maps to help out my father. <laughs> lucky, lucky, you're so lucky to have a fairy. I know, I know, we should be friends. Yes, yes, in exchange I will sell you a map for cheap as a sign of our friendship. Will you buy one of Tingle's maps? Shh, you know what, that actually may be useful, so sure. Yippee! Nice. Well, call again. Tingle, Tingle, Cuckoo, la -ba. These are the magic words that Tingle created himself. Don't steal them. Okay, you're just a fucking weirdest person, Tingle. What's with the grass moving? Well, night time on the first day already. Oh god. Fine. No! Night of the first day, 60 hours remaining. Damn. Already wasted half of my first day. Alright, so where is the fairy? In here maybe? Ah. Nope. Oh no, the great fairy! Oh, is it broken as well? Hello? Young one, please hear my plea. I have been broken and shattered to pieces by the masked skull kid. Please find the one stray fairy lost in town and bring her to this fairy fountain. Okay. Pretty sure this was Tingle's first appearance. He looks really weird in this game. Yeah. As a... Uh, his face doesn't really look too great in the uh, N64 graphics. Okay, where does this go? So I gotta find one fairy.
Beku scrub playground down this hole. Interesting. How about it? Will the young one will the young one play? Well, I've only got ten, so sure, let's do it. Alright then, use the Deku flower to... Okay, what am I doing exactly? If the time it takes you to get all the rupees is faster than the current record, you get an extravagant prize. But if you fall down below just once, it's over. The best time for today's game is a minute and fifteen. Get all the rupees faster than that. Okay, burrow into the deck flower, the game begins the moment you jump out. Okay. How many is there? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Time this. I may have timed that wrong. Not, maybe not. Oh god! Oh, I overshot it. God damn it! Rip. Felt good is no match for the great fairy. She said. Yeah, yeah, I know, right. I'd like to hang around, but I need to head out. I may be back later if you're still streaming. Alright, man. Thank you for stopping by the stream. I'll probably be streaming for about another... Probably about another three and a half-ish hours. So... If you uh, if you come back, then cool. Can I pop that balloon like this? Yeah, what are you doing, kid? What do you want, shrimp? I'm busy practicing with my blowgun. If you can't pop that balloon, then don't mess with Jim. Grr. Okay. Don't mess with Jim. Can I, can I really not get up here? Probably not. Oh, what the f- What are you doing, creep? I'm not doing anything suspicious, really. I mean... Okay, whatever. <laughs> so that's where I came in. Great fairy. Can't go that way because of that guy, so let's go this way. Oh no, wait, that's the way- that's the way I came in, wasn't it? Let's see what's up here. Oh, was it mail? Oh, it's a mailbox. I don't, okay, I'm good. I don't have any mail. East clock turn. Hello. If you want to pass through here, you have to say the secret code. No, I don't have it. Wrong. Jim said I can't let anyone who doesn't know the code in. If you're not a member, they will teach you the secret code. If you want to be a member, go see Jim. Okay, so I assume I gotta pop that balloon. And once I pop the balloon, Jim will let me in. He'll give me the code. Mayor's office. Uh, the mayor's official residence open to the public from 10 a.m. to 8 p.m. Okay. So I guess the first thing I gotta do is try and find this fairy. Who's lost. The secret route to the observatory? How do you know about that? Okay. We're literally just all gonna see the same shit. Question is, where is this goddamn fairy? Can't get. I can't leave town, which means it must be in town. Okay, can't enter there. I've already been in there, I think. Hmm. I feel like I've explored most of the town at this point, though. I have not seen a single fairy anywhere. Hmm. Hmm. 
Yeah. I think maybe that bottom left thing is the only place I've not been to. Yeah, I don't think I've been over here yet, so maybe this is where the fairy is. I'm hear that tune again. A frog? Hello. Yeah, can't speak to the frog. Oh, this guy. Now you're right here. La la la, they said I was too loud when I practiced in my room. They got mad. Sigh, now I'm sad. I'll just stay here all night and away from the pad. And you are a child, so you must get to bed. Okay. What the hell is this little, little area? If I can hop across water. Interesting. It's locked. Okay. What do you want, Tail? That skull cat has gone too far, we can't just let this happen. Quick, we have to find the stray fairy in town and return to the great fairy to normal. Well, look at the time, you don't even have three days left. Okay, thanks for that. Where the hell is the fairy? I feel like I've looked everywhere at this point. What is this little brown thing on the map? Is that a chest? Whoa, what's going on? Whoa! Oh, he <laughs> was freaking out about there. All right, well we've. I already spent one full day looking for a fairy that we have not found. Yo, have you seen a fairy? Grimoire, don't be standing around looking at your feet all day. Oh, maybe I can see that door in through here is opened yet. Once it was locked. Oh, there it is! Wait, what? Is it only here during the day? Or something? Please hear my plea, the mascot kid has broken me apart. Please find a way to return me to the... okay. I feel kind of gypped that that was only there during the second day. Or is it like, is there things like... Are things like stray fairies and stuff only in certain areas at certain like days or certain times or something? Hmm. Well, either way, at least we've we got it. And it is raining. for his fairy. <laughs> hey, welcome back, Derek. Tattle, and you, young one of the already of the altered shape. Thank you for returning my broken and shattered body to normal. I am the great fairy of magic. I thought that the masked child was helping me, and I grew careless. All I can offer you now is this. I shall grant you magic power as a sign of my gratitude. Please accept it. <laughs> All right, cool. We got magic already. That was fast. You've been granted magic power. If in your current form, press B to shoot bubble blasts. 
Permission hold B to blow a big bubble. Release B to shoot it. Your magic power decreases when you shoot. Replenish it with magic jars and potions. The man who lives in the observatory outside of town may know of the Skull Kid's whereabouts, but be careful. You must not underestimate that child's power, kind young one. If you... If ever you're returned to your former shape, come see me, I shall give you more help. Okay, so I'm assuming we can use our bubbles. Can we use our bubbles to pop that balloon and then Jamal gear us the code and then we can go into the observatory and go see this, this guy and see what you've got to say. Bam! Are you the one who just popped that up there? Not bad for a Deku scrub. We bombers have a hideout that leads to the observatory outside town. If you need a code to get in, maybe I'll tell you what it is. But don't think you're getting it that easily. I can't just tell you what the code is. You'll have to pass my test first. Okay. Alright, line up guys. Oh god. If you can find all five of us by tomorrow morning, I'll teach you the code. Are you ready? Oh Jesus. Ah, oh, this is just like Wind Waker. Alright, find the five kids. Oh, there's one. Oh, God. Stop! Ah, oh, you caught me! Now there are only four left. No, there's another one. That was easy. Ah, oh, you caught me! Now there's only three left. Probably only two here. Oh, hey, mailman. Hey, hey, mailman. That was a good one. Ah, oh, you caught me. No, there's only two left. But they're not exactly. Hidden. Actually, they all seem to be somewhat out in the open. I guess there's not one in the south part of town. Oh, there's one. Come here, you. No, I don't want to read the goddamn sign. No. I actually came here, though. How did I not get him? Actually, what? That was some bullshit. You fucking ran doing what I can to get him. Come here! I can't actually catch him. Oh, I did not mean to hit that chicken. I actually cannot catch this little shit. Jesus. Oops.
I fucking knew this guy would be up here. There we go. Ah, no way, you finally got me. Got him. You're pretty good for a Deku scrub. If only you were human. Then I could give you an original bomber's notebook and make you a member. What do you guys think? No way, no scrubs. Wow, fucking racist ass kids. I guess not. Once we let some, well, let, once we let some kid who has who wasn't human join our gang, and boy, did we ever regret regret it. Sorry, but I'll teach you the code just like I promised. I can tell you only. I can tell you only once, though. So pay pay close attention. Are you ready? One, two, three, four. But are you fucking kidding me? It's one, two, three, four, five. Wait, oh no, it's okay. It's two, five, one, four, three. Two five one four three. The entrance to our hideout is an East Clock Town. Two five one four three. All right. Well, I mean, as long as I can just get in there, I'm fine with that. If you want to pass through here, you have to see the secret code. Ah, that's right. If you know the code, then you're a member, right? Okay, here you go. Yeah. There's a lot of cool stuff at the telescope guy's place. Oh yeah, and um, the uh, Bomber Secret Society of Justice Forever. <laughs> Alright. Making progress, very slowly but surely. Oh, I gotta hop across the wall. Oh, oh god, hello. Ow, can I not? I apparently cannot. Screw you, Sculptula. Night of the second day, 36 hours remain. Those are some big ass paws. Oh, I wonder if maybe I could kill the Sculptula with the, uh, with my bubbles actually. Like a marsh. Oh, scarecrows here. What's up? Yo, hey baby, I'm styling I'm a styling scare scarecrow wandering in search of a pleasant music. Time will pass in the blink of an eye if you dance with me. If you like baby, we can forget. The time and dance till dawn. And yeah, okay, so this is just if you want to skip time. Oh, sorry, that's too bad. In that case, come back any time if you do decide you want to dance. By the way, I know of a mysterious song that allows you to manipulate the flow of time. Do you want to learn it? Yes. Oh, yeah, no, listen up. If you play that strange song backwards, you can slow the flow of time. And if you play the... And if you play each... Each note twice in a row, you can move. You can move half a day forward through time. How's that? Pretty interesting, isn't it? But I'm sure I'd like any. I'm sure I'd like any song written by you better, baby. If you like, you can play one for me. Um. How do I? Oh yeah, baby. Okay. So can I actually not? He's not going to teach me that until I have a song of my own. Okay. Then. I probably need my ocarina time, my ocarina bag before I can do that, I guess. Where's this guy? Oh, there he is. Oh, it's this old guy. Well, well, a strange looking child has joined me today. Are you a new friend of the bombers gang? Hmm. 
Your manners seem much better than those of the, your mischievous friends from the other day. <laughs> that ill-mannered troublemaker from the other day said he'd break my instruments. He said he'd steal my moon's tear. There was no stopping him. Oh, fucking... Who was it the one with the moon's tear? Oh, the oh yeah, the, the other scrub. Even now, just watch him. He's probably causing trouble around the clock tower. Will you gaze into the telescope? Sure. So this is outside the town. A huge wide open area. Oh, is that Decker Mountain in the background? Or some kind of other mountain, I guess. I suppose I'm supposed to look at the, the moon. Yep. Oh, maybe not. What's that? Ah! fuck was that? Oh, <laughs> he knows we're looking at him and he just... Wow, rude. Well, did you find that troublemaker? And that loud noise? What was that? Perhaps another moon's tear has fallen nearby. Go through, the, go through that door and take a look outside. But I wonder how that troublemaker got on top of the clock tower. The only way up there is through the clock door and that opens that that opens only on the eve of the carnival. Interesting. Gummins here. Its sparkling beauty radiates rather strangely. Anything else around here? Oh, hello. Jesus Christ. It's like my heart is being peered right into. That's a disturbing eye. Oh, you did not like that. I guess there's nothing else to do here. What could that troublemaker be doing atop the clock tower? I just hope he's not plotting another one of its and has no good tricks. Okay, so I guess we were just coming over here to get ourselves that tier so we can get to that Deku scrub so that we can use his thing, I assume, to get on the clock tower? Use his, his uh, flower thing to get up there. Why does he have a chicken in a cage? What the hell, man? <laughs> Alright, let's head back. We'll give this mintier to that. That dick is gonna... Oh yeah, it does work. Okay. Actually, okay, what do you want? Don't you remember that deck? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't be a navi. Okay, there's nothing up there. scrub guy was I think he was in the south part of town I assume that's where the clock tower is so that's probably where he is yeah dog I swear to god yo 
If you have a moon's tear, I must get it from you. My wife, my wife would love it. If you give it to me, I'll give you my spot here. All right. Oops. Ah, that stone, you must hand it over to me. In exchange, I'll give you my spot here, Deku Flower included. Yes? Yeah. You traded the moon's tear for a land title deed. You really helped me out. Now I have the perfect souvenir for my wife. She has set eyes on a jewel or strange sparkling stone like this in a very long time. The title deed for this spot should be in a high demand among Deku Scrubs, but you already know that. If you don't need it anymore, you can always sell it. Alright, see ya. Peace! Yeah! Yeah! Oh. The door to the clock tower opens only once a year at midnight on the eve of the carnival. When's the eve of the car- when is, it, when is that exactly? Oh, wait. Can I go in here? Ah, here we go. Yeah, I can find out what's going on. Up. Why, hello! Did you find that little imp? If you can get back the precious item that was stolen from you, I will return you to know. Okay. So when the hell is the carnival? Is, it, is the carnival on the last day? I assume. Since nothing's going on right now. Be sound looking at your feet. Hmm. Dog, would you actually leave me alone though? So can I just I assume the only thing I can really do right now is just wait until it's the carnival time? But it said midnight. Final day, 24 hours remain. So, is it the festival now? Absolutely guaranteed, we shall guard your assets, Clocktown Bank. Dog, I swear to God. That's something I can shoot. No, guess not. The door to the clock tower stairway opens at midnight on the eve of the carnival. Fireworks show will mark the occasion. Lockdown carnival. Okay. A chest I just saw. Would you actually go away though? What the hell is that guy even doing up there? Okay, so we have to wait till midnight tonight. And then we can go in there. Uh what to do in the meantime? That is the question.
What's in here? I don't think I don't think I went in here, did I? Ooh. Honey and darling shop. The hell is this? Oh, it's those two that like dance together. Um It looks like we have a visitor, honey. I wonder if it's a customer, darling. What shall we do, honey? I don't think this is one can use a bow. But it looks like he can shoot bubbles, so let's let him play, darling. Would you like to play this time? This time it's special. Today is target shooting day, isn't it, darling? Sure. At all the targets and the time it takes us to dance through one song. But if you fail from this, if you fall from this platform, you're out. Are you ready? Okay. Oh, Jesus. I can't even have one. I suppose I accidentally shot them. There we go. Oh, there's one left. Oh, there's two left. No, there's three left. Jesus Christ, I'm... All right, never mind. Okay, that's just really... That was just really awkward. I'm just going to leave. Stockpot in. What's this? Patron guidelines for the milk bar. We offer our customers limited run milk, thus we are a members only establishment. Those who do not have a proof of membership will be refused service. I sure I bet this was an actual normal bar in Japan and they changed it to milk. Because I can't have alcohol shown on a cat's game. <laughs> There's nobody even here. Alright. I mean, probably only open during the night, so that makes sense. Should tingle down? Ah, oh, sir. Hello, Mr. Fairy. Will you buy one of Tingle's maps? I assume I may actually need that woodfall one. Maybe I should try and get myself up to 40 rupees so that I can get that. Oops. Might as well, I'll try, might as well try this, uh, this ruby collecting thing again, over here. Why, well, since, well, since we're just kind of waiting around. different this time. Interesting. Oh, 
Oh shit. Oh no! Damn it. <laughs> I'm so bad at this. I didn't realise it was going to be actually different. That seems hard. Probably gotta yeah, move on. I don't know where I am. If I am I right above it? Okay. Ah, oh, shit. God damn it. Let's just leave. It's gonna be mid next somewhat soonish, so. Can I actually get that heart piece for you? Probably not. No. Oh, I like how there's just a regular heart up here now. Alright, yeah, I guess we'll just wait until it's midnight. And we can finally get in here. Now well, that's different. This guy doing here. He was only standing there before. Hey, Deku Kid. You waiting for us to finish the bridge from the Festival Tower to the Clock Tower entrance up there? Sorry, we apprentices panicked and ran away. This is all we get for a Festival Tower. It's not quite tall enough, is it? Sheesh. Even if we went to the top of the Festival Tower, we couldn't, wouldn't be able to get up to the Clock Tower entrance. I apologise for all this. I wish I could scare that moon away. That is real close. So what, they were supposed to build this tower up and then have it be a bridge over to the Clock Tower entrance and they just fucked it. Because of course they did. I'll just wait until it's midnight. The hell is that noise? Is that? I'm getting closer. Jesus. There we go. an actual staircase going up there. Alright. Don't stop now, look, you can get up there now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, 
let's see. Oh, hello. What the fuck? Oh, there he is. Success! Ah, Tail, we've been looking for you too. Hey, Skullkid, what if you gave that mask you're wearing back now? Hey, come on, are you listening? Swamp, mountain, ocean, canyon. Hurry, the four who are there, bring them here. Swamp, mountain, ocean, canyon. Don't speak out of line, stupid fairy. No, what are you doing to my brother? Skullkid, do you still think you're our friend after that? Well, whatever. Even if they were to come now, they wouldn't be able to handle me. <laughs> Just look above you. If it's something that can be stopped, then just try to stop it. Oh shit. Na 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 na, you got back of the arc, you didn't have time. It's... Suddenly memories of Princess Zelda come rushing back to you. Oh. You're already leaving this land of Hyrule, aren't you? Oh, excuse me. Even though it was only a short time, I feel like I've known you forever. I'll never forget the days we spent together in Hyrule. And I believe in my heart that a day will come when I shall meet you again. Until that day comes, please take this. I am praying, I am praying that your journey be a safe one. If something should happen to you, remember this song. Hey, the song of time. You remembered the song of time. This melody lingering on the edges of your mind is a song of memories of Princess Zelda. The goddess of time is protecting you. If you play the song of time, she will aid you. Snap out of it! What are you doing? Lost, lost in memories? Get yourself together! Getting that old ocarina back isn't going to help us. Somebody, anybody, goddess of time, help us please! We need more time! Huh? When did you get that instrument? Oh, what the fuck? Not an ocarina anymore, it's some weird horn thing. Alright. Save and return to the dawn of the first day? Sure.
What just happened? Everything has... Started over. Oh, what are you anyway? That song you played, that instrument. That instrument. Wait, that's it, your instrument. The mask salesman said that if you go back to the precious get back got back the precious thing that was stolen from you, he could return you to normal. Did you completely forget or what? No, actually I did not. <laughs> we didn't get back the mask though, so... Were you able to recover your precious item from that imp? Oh god! Oh, 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 you got it, you got it, you got it, you got it! What the fuck? Where did they get that? <laughs> Where did they get the organ from? What the fuck? And listen to me, please. Play this song that I am about to perform and remember it well. Of healing? Ah, oh, that turns me back. <laughs> Bye. Yeah. This is a melody that heals evil magic and troubled spirits, turning them into masks. I am sure it will be of assistance to you in the future. Ah yes, I give you this mask in commemoration of this day. Fear not, for the magic has been sealed inside the mask. When you wear it, you will transform into the shape you just wear. When you remove it, you will return to normal. Hey, we've got our first mask. Nice. You got the deck. You got the Deku mask to keep as a memento. All right. <laughs> now I have fulfilled my promise to you. So please give me that which you promised me. Um. Don't tell me. My mask. You did. Get it back, didn't you? Oh my god. Child abuse! What the fuck? Uh. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What have you done to me? If you leave my mask out there, something terrible will happen! The mask that was stolen from me, it's called Majora's Mask. It is an accursed item from the legend that is said to have been used by an ancient tribe in its hexing rituals. It is said that an evil and wicked power is bestowed upon the one who wears that mask. According to legend, the troubles caused by Majora's mask were so great. The ancient ones fearing such cat catastrophic Catastrophe sealed the mask in shadows forever, presenting its misuse. But now, that tribe from the legend has vanished, so no one really knows the true nature of the mask's power. But I feel it. I went to great lengths to get that legendary mask when I finally had it. I could sense the doom of a dark omen brewing in it. Brewing? It was that unwelcome feeling that makes your hair stand on end. And now, that imp has it. 
I am begging you, you must get that mask back quickly or something horrible will happen. I'm begging you, I'm begging you, you must do it. <laughs> really? You'll do it for me? I mean, I kind of have to at this point. I was certain you would tell me that. You'll be fine, surely you can do it. Believe in your strengths, believe. Okay then. I just know- wait, what? I just noticed that. We don't have any Deku nuts or rubies? What the hell happened? Where the hell did all my shit go? Good. Okay. That mask. The Skull Kid uses the power of that mask to do those terrible things. Well, whatever it takes. We gotta do something about it. The swamp, mountain, ocean and canyon. That tale was trying to tell us about. I bet he was referring to the four areas just outside town. There's one in each compass direction. But what do you suppose that he meant by the four who are there? I have no idea. He always skips important stuff. I guess we should just go find out. If we go through that gate straight ahead, we'll be heading to the direction of the swamp. Alright. Oh, hey Aiden. How's it going, man? I'm good. How you doing? You are oh, because we went back in time. We never got them. Interesting. So that, does that mean every single time I have to go back to the dawn of the first day, I'm gonna lose every, like, I'm gonna lose like all my rubies and like ammo for everything I have? That's a pain in the ass. <laughs> what? Jesus. All right. Um. Before we continue, I need to go take a quick bathroom break. So I will be right back, and then I guess we'll start heading to the swamp. So I'll be back in a minute guys. <laughs> 